Uh, well, I think uh, we had a very good start. Uh, we, we started very well. I think in the first first minute we would have, you know, been one up. A uh, good chance there uh, from tables as cross, and we dominated. I think uh, in in midfield as well. Our pressing was very good. We knew that we wanted to try and put pressure on Rivaldo and Jali. And I think we did that very well up to the seventh minute, and uh, the red card as well didn't, you know, do any justice to us. Uh, it's always difficult to play with one main shot if you're playing against a team like you know Sundowns with their quality. But in terms of our work ethic, we played very well with and without the ball. Uh, even though with, uh, with, with one main shot, we still created another opportunity. Uh, before they even scored, I think we could have been two or three nil up. Uh, it was only a moment of you know just lapse in concentrate concentration in our in in the, in, the, in the space of ten minutes where. Uh, Sundown scored those three goals, uh, but second half we came back very strong because I told the players that we got to you know uh, show character in the second half and you know win the second half. We lost the first half, but let's try and go out there and win this, the second half. And I think the players did very well. They worked very hard. Uh, we scored a goal and uh, Dennis made a good save as well. And the dead there uh, from Jones, you know says. Uh, head. I think you know scoring goals has been a huge you know problem for us, especially in the second round of the season where we not scoring more than one goal. So sometimes if you don't score goals, it's always difficult to win a game. Good evening, coach. Unlucky on the result, coach. Uh, what has what has disappointed you the, uh, disappointed you the most this evening? Is it because you lost, or is it because you partly contributed to your bitter rival Sundowns winning the league title? Because maybe you could have held them for one more week. And secondly, coach, when I spoke to you uh, earlier on in the season, one position that has always troubled you has been the left back position, uh, because obviously Mahachi is more of a left winger. Is it the position that you also be looking at bringing in another left foot and left back at the end of the season? Thank you. Yeah, look, uh, for me, the only disappointing thing, you know, in this game is uh, the first one is the chances that we created that we could have uh, uh, done better. Uh, maybe we could have scored a little bit more because when you play against a team like Sundowns, you've got, to, you've got to score goals because they've got a lot of quality. And the second one was also the red card. I think the way it happened, uh, it, was a, it was a right call. You know, after watching it again, I thought it was a right call. Uh, so early in the game, and that puts you in a, in a in a in a very difficult you know situation where, when we started, we wanted to press a little bit high up, and we did very well when we did that. Uh, but all of a sudden, we had to try and sit back now. So which means we had to play more without without the ball, and that limits you know you in terms of going forward and you know creating opportunities. But in terms of work ethic, I think we we played very well. Uh, in terms of the left back position, we've always had you know problems there, eh? uh, and we were trying to convert uh, you know you know Kuda and make him a little bit more a a a, a full back who gives us a little bit more options in terms of going forward. Uh, but he's still adjusting to that. Uh, he got caught you know defensively, you know a lot of times. Why? Because we want to make sure so. We wanted him to go forward. So team played very well. Young Jesse Don uh, worked his socks off. Tebza was was brilliant. Bradley, uh, the young Keenan, uh, Jones Lungu when he came when he came on, he did very well. So the whole team, you know, played very well. I think it was just unfortunate that we lost the game. Uh, thank you, Shubi. Uh, unlucky coach on the result. Uh, they say hindsight is the best side. You had such a good uh, start to the season. In your opinion, where do you think you 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 fell short? Thank you. It's uh, quite a very good, you know, uh, question. I think uh, we started the season very well uh, because if you if, if you can look at the makeup of our team, uh, we don't need a lot of depth uh, and depth was in quality in terms of depth as well. Uh, we lost, you know, quite a few influential players in terms of injuries, like Brady Krobler, uh, Gabuza. He's only coming back now, but I think his first start, you know, after four, three months. Uh, Jones Lung as well was injured. Even Julie Manziba, he was injured as well. 
Uh, so it was a little bit difficult and we had to play a little bit more younger players. And I think we, 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 that's when you see the emergence of uh, Jesse Don playing a little bit more regularly. Uh, and also the young Kenan Phillips also playing a little bit more, more, more regularly. So that kind of like, you know, put us a little bit in a, you know, on the back foot, you know, in terms of consistency. But uh, I'm quite happy with uh, where we were going because uh, we've given opportunities to, to other players and some players have grabbed their opportunities and we're looking forward, you know, to build, you know, for next season. Um, on the next two matches, I think you've got Marisberg and Chipa. What will be uh, your targets for those games, you know, given um, the positions and the desperation for points of the opposition? Uh, look, our approach is always the same. Uh, each and every game, we treat it, you know, we treat all our games the same. And I think uh, the last two games are not different to, to, to this one in terms of how we want to prepare and how we approach them.